Greetings, this is a quick response to a headline I saw from a Swedish journalist, I suppose, or at least a journalist in Sweden, Peter Volodarski, and he uses my picture here on a, a little essay where he talks about extremism. So I would just like to ask you, Peter, here, exactly why are you using my picture in relation to extremism, misogyny and fake news. First and foremost, I have a daughter and a wife I love extremely much. I don't know if you can say the same. Either way, I challenge you to point to any of my videos where I have expressed any misogynistic views. I also challenge you to point exactly to what video or Instagram post where I have been extreme in my rhetoric. And also lastly, where and when have I spread fake news. So it seems to me like you are projecting here. I know your colleagues, male feminists and journalists do not have the best view of women. You talk a lot about how you respect women etc. But usually the truth is something different and we can see that with the Me Too campaigns a lot of your colleagues got uh, busted there. So maybe you should be a bit more humble. Uh, and again Please show me some examples why are you using my picture in relation to these terms. I'd be happy to see what exactly you view in my message that is extreme or hostile to females or when or where I have spread fake news. So yeah, that's just a short video response. Again, it's important for me to meet these sort of accusations or allegations head on directly. Uh, to avoid any misconceptions and also to my subscribers I know these aren't the most entertaining of videos but um, still needs to be done and uh, it's important for us to take measures against these fake news journalists in, um, in uh, the information war so to speak so thank you for watching XXO boom